Good morning, everyone. I'm Riley King, and welcome to my morning news report right here on the Riley King Network. Let's begin. Take a look at this photo right here. New Hampshire businesses, consumers worry about effects of threatened tariffs. Trump says he'll impose tariffs on Mexico imports. Some New Hampshire businesses are worried about the impact of potential new tariffs against Mexico imports President Donald Trump has threatened to impose. Trump said Thursday he would impose a 5% tariff on all Mexico imports on June 10th unless the country stops the flow of Central American migrants into the United States. Experts said the tariffs would eventually raise the price of a wide range of products from beer to automobiles for U.S. consumers. Some New Hampshire businesses have a manufacturing presence in Mexico or rely on exports. Much of the fresh produce in U.S. grocery stores is grown in Mexico. Kevin Daigle of New Hampshire Groceries Association said low-income consumers would be hardest hit by the proposed tariffs. Trump said he would raise the tariffs to 25% by October if Mexico hasn't stemmed the flow of migrants. Daigle said stores will try to hold off on passing the cost along aimed slim margins and other tariffs already in place. A local auto dealer told News 9 he's not sure if or how his business would be affected, but Cody Lusk, president of the American International Automobile Dealership Association, said the effects could be damaging. News of the potential tariffs sent stocks tumbling Friday, with the Dow Joe's Industrial Average closing down about 355 points, or 1.4%. Mexico's president has sent his foreign secretary to Washington to try to negotiate a solution to prevent the tariffs from being imposed. And that does it for my morning news report right here on the Riley King Network. I hope you all have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you back here later on today for another news report. Goodbye, everyone.